Ooh. Oh, one of those. Oh, one of them. Oh, oh. This one got me so many times, and I was very upset after like two oh, he's, hours. He's got like a karate kick going there. Yeah, it was almost killed me in one shot. Oh my god, they hit so hard. Well, look at him. I want to know how he sees where you're at. He probably smells me with his tongue. Ew. I fell. Yeah, no, but I don't oh, know what to do. Are you going back to fight him some more? Yeah, he drops a good item, but I don't remember what it was. I don't know if it's good enough. <laughs> that ain't worth it. I don't care what yeah, it is. I'm serious. Those there long we go. legs and that icky tongue. The icky sticky tongue. Yeah. Oh, it's a sword that we're never going to use. See, I told you, you should have just kept moving. But we killed him. We did it. We triumphed. Well, we did triumph. There was so much we? triumph going on. I like triumph. I like saying it too. It's a great word. It really is. We gotta fight a bunch of skeletons. A skeleton uh, of them. A skeleton. Would you like a plank ton of bubbles, SpongeBob? <laughs> and then he goes <laughs> when the SpongeBob is going. Bah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow, follow the, the yellow, yellow brick, brick road. road. Follow, 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 follow the yellow brick road. <laughs> <laughs> wherever, wherever a wizard there was, the wizard would die as a wombie god. Because, 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 because of the, the wonderful things he does. <laughs> that was beautiful. Thank you. This place is beautiful too. Look at it. It's gorgeous. Oh. Terrifying, but gorgeous. All right, so there's a giant uh, thing that shoots us from over there. Awesome. The old demon king's through that door over there. Sweet. But there's going to be a gigantic worm. Oh, a gigantic worm. And there it is. We're not going to fight it, uh, but we're going to try and run past it. I hope I never get worms. Well, if you get one like that, you're not going to survive. Well, I'd uh, probably be thin if I had one. I who did, cares? I did flirt with the idea of having a tapeworm. And that's a terrible idea. It I'm is. glad you did not go through with I it. I did not go through with it. But I don't like being overweight. Well. But I like to eat. What's the answer? Find a monkey's paw and make a wish on it. Where do I find a monkey's paw? I've got a couple in my basement. Can I have All right, one? Old Demon King time. Oh. Oh. Eh. Eh. Yeah. That was cool. I like him. He's not a great boss, but he's not terrible. I think he's kind of cool. Does he have Good a tree night. as a beard? Nah. He's just got a face. What's hanging off uh, his chin? This is bad. My positioning was bad from the start. Oh, you're gonna take his legs out from under him. I'm gonna take his legs and sell them on eBay. I bet you get a good deal. Not everybody has those legs. You're right, only he does. But once I'm done with them, someone well, else, else will. will. Exactly. What do you think? A collector's a good... item. Yeah. What do you think's a good price for the uh, authentic old Demon King legs? I'm saying a hundred thousand. All right, I'll, I'll gladly take a hundred grand for this old man's life. I can see people paying a hundred grand for that to be able to say they have it. He's making the meteors fall. Oh, he's oh he didn't like that we're gonna sell his legs. He's mad now. I'd be upset too. So oh, I'm, I'm sorry. We shouldn't have said that out loud. He's a sympathetic Look at him. He's really upset. Ow! Stop. Ooh, well, we did kind of say we were gonna sell his legs. You're hurting me. Oh, he really is coming after you. We're not having played this for like a month at this point. I'm doing pretty swag. You're doing really swag. I jinxed it. <sighs> Ow, right in the heel. Oh, that hurt. I cut his um Achilles tendon. Yeah, like in uh Pet Cemetery. Oh, Pet Cemetery. Do you remember okay, so when we were kids, my mom was like, never watch the movie <laughs> Children of the Corn. <laughs> it is the scariest Stop movie I've ever seen. <laughs> Stop! And Stop! Then, you're making me look lame. <laughs> what? Ten years later, she's like, "All right, I'm gonna. We're gonna watch this together. <laughs> now, if you get too scared, it's okay." I remembered it being scary. Okay. I think I left halfway through because I was bored. Hayden stuck it through with me, and I kept saying, <laughs> "Hayden, just hang on. It's gonna get scary. It's coming. I can. It's coming." And then at the end of the movie, he looked at me. He goes, "Mom, <laughs> where's the scary?" Mom, Where's is your scary brain part? okay? <laughs> <laughs> like, I could have sworn there was a scary part. But there wasn't. But there wasn't. This is really boring old Stephen King Well, movie. I just felt so dumb because <laughs> I, was, I thought we were going to share this epic moment of fright. <laughs> and it never happened. To fearful friends. It never happened. And that's so, okay because now we have a fun memory. 
Well, yeah. Instead that's, of a scary uh, one. <laughs> all the memories turned out to be me doing something stupid. <laughs> Instead of traumatizing her children, she ended up, uh, I don't know. Entertaining them. Yeah. With fake tales of horror. <laughs> uh, that's good stuff. Yeah, real good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> And now everybody out there is going, oh my gosh, she thought Children of the Corn was scary. Yeah, now anytime oh. people think of the old Demon King after watching this, they'll think of the time Mama Tess was scared of Children of the Corn. <laughs> what a wonderful thing. I think it's more that I'm afraid in the, in the, okay, so it's getting to be fall and the corn dries out, but you still can't see people in the corn. We did it. And it's dark and I'm driving home. We do live I'm in a bunch of corn fields. I'm always afraid some half dead kid's gonna come out of the corn. <laughs> Some scrawny begotten child. And they're gonna trick me and kill me. I can't believe you beat that. That was amazing. You, you can't believe I beat that? I mean, so quickly. Oh, okay. I think it would have taken most people <laughs> a lot longer. I was about that. Well, it took me a long time. I've beaten him before. Well, I thought you did fantastically. Oh, I'm so happy we get to go see Irithyll. Irithyll? Irithyll? <laughs> You really hear <laughs> Shut up. I love hear I was going to try and do something with that. Maybe <laughs> I was going to act like I really knew what we were talking about, but then you, you called me out. I was, I'm, I'm quick to the jump of making yeah, fun you, of others. You called me out. Uh, Put a couple into endurance. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you laugh at that? Or were oh, you still nothing. laughing at the last thing? No, I'm laughing at endurance. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go see Irithyll, one of the most beautiful places in this game. All right, yeah, I was really jazzed about that. Yeah, you were like, Irithyll! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna sick uh, my sleeping dog on you. Well, we're getting to... I didn't think we were gonna do Irithyll tonight, but we're gonna but we start it at least. are, because it's poggers! Irithyll is so poggers! All right. Here we go. It's coming. Oh, I'm Everyone so Everyone hold on to your hats. All right, I'm holding on to mine. Onion head. Whoa. Oh. oh, my gosh. It is absolutely gorgeous. That is so beautiful. The rest of the game before this was like gray and gross. Right. But Look at blue. it. Blue. Oh, it's gorgeous. After, I've only gotten to like the area past Irithyll. Yeah. So after that, we're going to struggle. Oh, but okay. until then, we're still going to struggle because I'm not very good with Irithyll, but we will get through it. There's a guardian of this gate. For some reason, it reminds. Oh, oh, that's <laughs> quite a guardian. Put up the spirit of vengeance from oh, Berzer. Oh, oh, he grabbed me. Oh. That was bad. Oh, I can't believe I just didn't watch my child be eaten by that thing. <laughs> he has electric breath, because, you know, dog. Ah! Ah! Oh, you said dog and ha Hayden. Oh, <laughs> look, you woke up. <laughs> Hayden, if you ever watch this, uh, mom just <laughs> called you a dog. I don't necessarily uh, fall now, in line with that logic, Hayden, but... who is most important in my world? The dog. So if I'm calling you the dog, that means you are awesome. The, the D-O-double-G. Yeah. Like, 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 like Snoop. Come on, buddy. Up here. Come on, onion head. Oh, oh, now be careful this time. That thing's treacherous. Hiya! Ooh. Oh my gosh. This I, guy took me a long time to I beat I think he's before. one of the scariest ones oh. I've seen. Oh. oh, you just got him in the rib cage and... Oh, he's writhing in pain. Oh! What? Oh. How did I kill him so fast? Because you're epic. Your epicness. Well, all right. Everything's going my way. Don't get too cocky too soon. No, don't worry. Irith, will beat me down. I can tell you that much. Okay. A ghost. Ooh. Uh, these tall people suck. I do not like fighting them. You don't like tall people? No. <laughs> they make me feel insecure about my stature. But these guys are fast and annoying. See? Are they ghostly? Nah. They're... Oh, they're like mini dancers. They die easily. They do, but when you're... Okay, when I did this all, I was under-leveled, so they were like one-shotting me, and it took me like five hits to kill them. So they're dancers? Yeah. There's a boss called the Dancer later. 
Uh, you've seen me do the dancer before, but this is basically just a smaller version is of that thing. Is it like thing. that bird mating dance that you do? No, it's not, and I haven't done that in probably over a decade, so I think it's fine if we stop bringing it up. But it was epic the way you did it. It wasn't epic. It, it was, was a child epic. trying to make his mother you laugh. You were a child. And that's the most epic thing of all. If you had been a child, it would have been. I was a child. Older. How old was I? A couple years ago. It was not a couple years ago. It was like a decade. No, that's how I remember. A couple years ago. Well, you don't remember that well. We were watching so. that bird show, and you were like, oh, I can do that. And I did <laughs> very well, but she still brings it up, and I don't like it. Because I love it. It's it was cringe. so cute. It's so cringe. It was so cute. It makes my chest tight with the cringe. Oh, honey, get over it. How sweet are you being stupid? <laughs> <laughs> Don't you know you're not embarrassing, sweetheart? You're not embarrassing. And everybody thinks you're adorable, so I don't know why you think anybody would think that was wrong. She's inflating my ego. I hope all of you are witnessing that. Well, so when I become a jerk YouTuber later in the future, <laughs> you can attribute it to her. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. Oh, oh. no. Oh. oh, that didn't do that he much damage. He threw you off oh, of his flaming doohickey. He threw me for a loop. I was, oh no, I stopped. I'm telling you what, this this stuff is, wow. This is so dark and edgy. It's so dark and edgy. But you know what else it is? What? Poggers. It is so it's poggers. It's so poggers. <laughs> it is so poggers. It's poggerific. Ah, uh, that was not poggers though. Oh, there we go. I love that little dancing twirl. <laughs> <laughs> I know you do. <laughs> I'm going to do that at work tomorrow, too. You're becoming influenced by the souls that are dark. I am Three. influenced by everything. It's ridiculous. That's life. And then people say, I say, I'm 60 years old. And people go, no, you're not. You watch One Piece. You're not 60. You know what One Piece is. I know, right? You know Eustace Captain Kid. You're not lame. That's what that's what all the kids gather around you at the orphanage say. They do. Well, I can't help it that I love <laughs> good art, you know? You like high art, that fancy stuff. The stuff that makes a uh, Mozart curl his toes into exactly. light. Exactly. Exact the mundo. <laughs> exactly. Like when Mozart curl his toe, it makes me woe. <laughs> <laughs> you want to know the three lessons of comedy? Yes. Say to say something that uh, people aren't expecting. Okay. Rhyme. Okay. Or forget what you were about to say. Well, I always say things that people can't believe somebody would say. Yeah. Because I don't have a filter. Well, it's more. F it's funny. Being well, people think it's random. funny, but then I'm afraid I'm going to get fired or in trouble. Well, you got to find the balance. I forgot to do the plunge attack on this guy. Ooh. The polar plunge. There we go. Would you ever go swimming in ice water? Yes. Oh, I was expecting a no from that. It depends. Is there money involved nope. or am I just doing it to do it? You're doing it for recreation. Okay, am I recreating with people? Or animals. Or am I by myself? You're with the polar bear but he's not a bad polar bear then i would yeah he's if, the coca-cola mascot oh well definitely yeah but not the weird cg ones he's the one of the guy in the suit but he's not a guy in a suit he just looks like that as long as there's a cold coca-cola <laughs> involved <laughs> i'll be there okay so put the cold coca-cola at like the bottom of the uh cold water i'll dive down for that nice well someone go hide a Coca-Cola, <laughs> cold body of water. Let's call her out. See if she'd do it. We'll see if she finds it, sniffs it out with her bloodhound nose. See if she does it. I don't like to be underwater, though. Uh, make it a shallow pool, but enough that she has to put her head under to grab it. Okay. But not enough that if she slipped and fell, she would drown. Um, it's mostly the sea monsters I'm afraid of. Oh. Or the, the, you know, the toothy fish. I thought and it was the, the more real... It's the Humboldt squid that really has me freaked Don't out. Don't put Humboldt squids in there. She's scared of those. I'm terrified of Humboldt squids. And you should be too. Why don't you tell them why? Okay, here's why. So this dude thought they were so cool and fascinating, so he wanted to study them, right? Seems logical. So he, dump, he dumps in, he jumps into the water, 
And the first thing that happens, he sees one and he's like, oh, and he puts his arm out. The thing pulls his arm out of socket right off the bat. So now he's a little concerned. <laughs> really? And so <laughs> then one gets on each leg and they start pulling him under. Then another one gets his other arm and he's trying to fight it off, but they've drug him down so far so fast, his eardrum bursts. Whoa. He manages to get them off, gets to the top, gets in the boat. They had to pop his arm back into place. And the guy that was with him he had broken ribs from the tax of the humble squid. So why are you scared of them? Because I don't want them <laughs> dragging me underwater, pulling my arm out of socket. They're trying to kill you, man. That does sound kind of painful. They don't mess around. I'm not going to lie. And they take you down to the Kraken. The Kraken. I thought it was to Davy Jones. That's his locker. Is the Kraken in Davy Jones's locker? Yes. Hmm. Now we know. Now we know. And I don't want to be eaten by a Kraken and drugged <laughs> down by Humboldt squids that I thought were cute. What about a butt Kraken? Well, it depends on if it's a hairy one or if it's a <laughs> clean smooth shaven one. Because smooth butts are cute, hairy ones aren't. Mm. Good to know. Well, I'm here to give you know. <laughs> I'm here to answer the tough questions. Uh, tough questions with uh, Mama Tess. Exactly. New show coming to you every coming to you live every flatter day. Every flatter day. That's right. We invented a new day of the week. Deal with it. Haha. <laughs> Puts on sunglasses. Yeah. Puts on pixel sunglasses. Becomes epic. Epic. Ooh, an undead bone shard. Hooray! Woo -woo! That will make our healing heal even more. Are the stars out tonight? I can't tell if it's cloudy or bright. Girl, I only have eyes for you. Look, dogs with human faces. That's not right. Oh, oh no. Oh my gosh, they're out of control. They need to have a leash on them. Where's the leash law in this land? Where is the leash? Someone bring it to me so I can put it on this dog. They've unleashed the teethy critters. They've unleashed the beast. Yes. And they'll do it again for 955. I think I pulled my arm out of socket when I was reenacting the Humboldt squid pulling <laughs> an arm out of socket. You're a little too uh, oh, in the moment. I was a little too aggressive there. Maybe I'm a Humboldt squid. She's got Humboldt squid DNA. She's squid girl. Now, I do like calamari. I'm not going to lie. Well, I don't think a squid would like calamari considering they are calamari. I know. It's like, I don't like human steak. But you've never tried one. And I don't plan on it. I could get you one. Really? Yeah. You're in the you're in the black market. I'm on the dark Trading. web. <laughs> Come check out Mama Tess on the dark web. <laughs> no, she sells you? human meat. I don't even know <laughs> where the dark web is. Everyone draw pictures of Mama Tess as a butcher. I used to call it the black meat. web. So I, I <laughs> the have no idea where it's at. Uh, Odin, stop knocking on the door. You want it out? Knock, knock, knock. On the ceiling, if you want <laughs> me. <laughs> on the ceiling. Twice on the floor. Means the answer is no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, my darling. <laughs> She's losing her mind at a rapid rate. Send your donations, please. We can't afford counseling anymore. All of them quit. <laughs> no, I just forgot to go to the last one. <laughs> if we can't get her to a counselor soon, they're going to make her get lobotomized, and I can't live without my mommy. No, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> I need her for the YouTube show. Oh. Because she says dumb stuff. <laughs> Me and Josh don't get the views we need. We need Mama Tess to supplement our oh. viewership. <laughs> <laughs> and then it was quiet. <laughs> For just a moment. Until oh, we're outside. Yeah, look. Oh. Oh my gosh, we fell down. Slipped and fell. It was an accident on my I behalf. I think Odin's worried about you. I don't care. He's he heard fine. you fall. He's okay. Uncle Sherman love him every day. Uncle Sherman, isn't that from that show with the dog Peabody? Peabody. 
Peabody and Uncle Sherman. Yeah, there you go. He's like 45 years old and still hanging out with his <laughs> dog dad. <laughs> Sherman, get your finger out of your bum bum. <laughs> <laughs> we don't put our fingers up there, Sherman. We only do that when we hum with the finger in our bum. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know you anymore. Did you ever really know I don't, me? I guess not, because now you're just some crazy lady cackling about fingers and bum bums when you hum hum. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Somebody help us, we're losing our <laughs> minds in Irithil well, of the Boreal Valley. Well, there's just so many Valley. skeletons that eventually it takes these a These aren't on skeletons. You. What are these? These are decrepit hobos. They're skeletons. They're decrepit hobos. They're skeletons. Look, you can see. That's a derogatory term. It is, isn't it? <laughs> Everybody has a skeleton. But nobody is a skeleton. No, we are. It's the core of our being. Okay, but would you let your skeleton define you as a person? Well, yeah, it's skinnier than I am. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think I've got a gorgeous skeleton. What in the world? <gasps> oh, that's horrifying. Aren't they beautiful? No. They sing the song of a mermaid's tail. Oh, no, thank you. They're, oh. they're under the this water. This is creepy. I don't like this part. Yeah, this part's a little, little bit spooky. A little bit, a little bit a whole creepy. Lot spooky. I had a cat named Spooky once. Was he a good cat or a bad cat? Well, it depends. I thought that Spooky was a wonderful cat. But then we moved into this house that had white carpeting. And my mom had a plant in black dirt in the room with white carpeting. And Spooky thought it'd be fun to poop in the plant and then <laughs> scrape the dirt out onto the white carpet. Spooky's a real one. And Spooky never came back. I like how it... It, like, we played the game Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion, but you didn't think about your cat Spooky until we stopped playing the game <laughs> with the name Spooky in it. <laughs> well, Spooky came to us in a pillowcase. Floating down the river? No, my aunt. <laughs> my your, aunt your aunt had, was floating down the river? No, my aunt had Spooky, and Spooky traveled better in a pillowcase for whatever reason. Okay. And I was very concerned that it, it was being <laughs> dropped off in a pillowcase. <laughs> but Spooky and I went on many adventures. Many adventures. Many, many adventures together. Regale us with the tales of Spooky's pillowcase adventures. Well, when Spooky got to the house and out of the pillowcase, <laughs> she ran into my dollhouse. And I have a picture of my mom, my brother and I, all looking at this house. But what people don't understand is there's a cat in it. But you, you don't, don't see the cat. In the picture? Yeah, you can't see Why the Why do I take the picture then? I didn't take the picture. Oh, uh, okay. I'm in the picture. <laughs> well, that's like taking a but picture. But I'm grinning from ear to ear because my cat's in my dollhouse. That's so funny that the cat's not even in the picture. Not even in the picture. Oh! Now you're going to see a lot of these guys for a while. I don't while. like those guys. <clears throat> what about this dead maggot man? Oh, I don't like maggots either. On the Monster Quest show, they showed... Um, a time elapse of a deer disintegrating into nature. Yeah. And the amount of maggots on it was horrifying. It's like me every night. So are maggots flies? Yeah. They're, they're baby flies? They're fly larvae. Well, they're disgusting. Flies lay their eggs in uh, garbage, and then the baby comes out, little maggot boy, eats until... The garbage. Yeah, eats until it turns into a fly. And then flies away to create more little maggots over the course of like two days. That's disgusting. Ah! Oh, jeez. Their hair is creepy. This is a good place to grind for souls if anyone gets to this point and has a hard time. I've this spent hours here. This is a great place here. to run and never look back. We got a dung pie. A dung pie? Delicious. Ew. I was Princess Dung Beetle. You were. And I was diving dragonfly. No, Hayden was diving dragonfly. Oh, did I say something? Was mine like a lightning bug or something? Yes. I was such a lame kid. I, when I was a kid, I wanted my I wanted a nickname, but I I tried to pick one out for myself, which isn't how that works <laughs> at all. That's not how it works at all. And my first one I wanted was Heat Blast, the Ben 10 <laughs> alien. <laughs> I was at Walmart and I was like, Mom, can you call me Heat Blast? And she said, Sure. And then never called me Heat Blast. For the best. Yes. 
I was helping you not be <laughs> beat up by other children. <laughs> <laughs> and then the second one, I wanted to be called Spike from X-Men. Yeah. Because I thought he was cool. You need your own nickname. I just got excrement covered ashes. That sounds awesome. I know, right? I call him Hunt Tommy. You got like 20 different nicknames for me. I do have all kinds of names for you. Look at this nice little kitchen. That is a nice little kitchen. I like it a lot. Let's whip up some stew. Well, hello, little boy. Would you like a nice <laughs> pot of sh a nice Ding. pot of stew? Yes. Yes, he would. Are you okay, I'll make you the stew. You so well, please. <laughs> they have nice furniture in this place. Oh, here's a uh, misogynistic joke. Okay. You see all these dishes? Yeah. Uh, this note says, woman required a head to wash the dishes. Excuse me, what? <laughs> Uh, Excuse me, what? <laughs> Excuse me, what? We're not going to be playing this game if it has things like that in it. <laughs> it's not in the... Okay, it's in uh -huh. the game, but it's... Yeah, it's user, explain this way. It's user-created. It wasn't made by the people who made the game. Are you sure? Yes. Then how do I find the knucklehead who put that in there? Uh, Plot twist, you don't. Plot that twist, black I knight. do. I'll give him a purple nurple. Look, a black knight charges forth. Well, another one shoots me from behind. Oh, does he have lightning in his sword? He sure does. And lightning deals extra damage. Well, of course it does. Oh, everybody knows that. No, he got me. Oh, I'd say he got you. Oh, and it won't stop. Uh, future me slash editor, can we get a trombone going? <laughs> That'd be perfect. Thank you. Um. Oh my god, you scared me to death. What was that for? What is wrong with you? I ate Taco Bell. You did not. 